Hi, excuse me. Do you know where the Riz Academy is? No clue. There's this like Riz Academy in Singapore, which is quite popular. Yeah. yeah. Then there's like Skibidi toilets there. Have you been there? No, I haven't. I don't know. I've been trying to find also, but I cannot find as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Maybe cool. we might have to ask one of the locals. I'm so sorry for this clickbait title. But how on earth do people do this? How do people just go up to strangers and start a convo? So anyways, for context right, I actually wanted to create a video where I approach strangers in public right, and then just start awkward conversations with them. But I don't know, it just felt so painful. Even for myself. Yeah, I don't know. It's so awkward. Let me show you some of the clips. Do you know any good food? Because I'm looking to buy food for my grandma as well. <laughs> well, I mean, Hawk Center is pretty much where we've been to. What do you recommend for like someone who's old, who doesn't really have much teeth to eat? Huh? Because she's a bit old and then she doesn't have a lot of teeth to eat. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, soft. I, I would say just any of the food courts, you can go and have a look and see what's, uh, right, right. what's there. Yeah. I mean, I technically did accomplish my goal of making things so good. I guess the whole issue is that I didn't really have a structure to follow in terms of the convo and I had to like waffle at the top of my head. Like, kind of what I'm doing in this video over here. So, whenever I approach a stranger, when I talk to them, right, it just felt so like hesitant because I, I was always trying to think of something stupid to say. Hi, could you let me take a picture of the fountain? Yeah, yeah, because this, this fountain is very famous. It's very, it's like known. It's like a trademark in Singapore. Just like over here and me in the background there. Okay. Yeah, I can help you take if you want as well. Do you want? Uh, this is a very well known fountain that was made by one of the politicians in Singapore. Yeah, that's why. And then that's why there's like three of them actually, so it's like three different politicians as well. I can take a No, no, thank you. We're looking for the bus stop actually. And then just not only that, right? I think just in general, approaching people with that wrong intention is very scary for me. Like my mind is like, what if they're not cool with it? Or what if they become angry? So I was just like super hesitant now when I was out there, you know, reaching out to the people. It's quite funny, right? I talk about trolling people, but then I troll myself in the end. Ah, oh, I don't know, man. It's so difficult. But then again, it's so fun creating these awkward conversations. But maybe now with more practice just now, right? I think maybe the next one, I might just need to script out what I need to say in terms of the awkward conversation so that I'll be ready in the next video. So, you know, y'all better drop that subscribe, man, because I'll be releasing the craziest, most entertaining video the next time around. Oh, we got to bounce anyway for it. Oh, Cheers. Actually, I wanted to ask you, like, do you know anywhere I can get a drink as well? No clue, bro. No, no clue. Bro. We're just here day one.